we can swivel and rotate this 360 degrees up or down to get the exact angle that we want to capture our shot. Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the Elgato Wave mic arm mount. I did purchase this product myself and any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Take a look at the retail box and packaging. Everything looks great, very simple, straightforward. On this side, they walk you through everything that's included and product dimensions for you. And we have some additional tech specs and product features on this side of the packaging, as well as Elgato's logo and branding. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and look at the contents. Here are all the contents. First up, we have our product literature going over our measurements, dimensions, how to set up the desk clamp. We also have our fine tune adjustments and cable management options, product warning and disclaimer information in multiple languages. Next, you'll notice we have an envelope with our Allen wrench and two threaded adapters, a quarter inch to three eighths inch and a quarter inch to five eighths inch adapters. We have a counterweight here, depending on your microphone, you might want to use that with your arm. We have the desk clamp with Elgato's logo and branding, additional product info there. It is padded, so we have nice padding here to protect the surface of our tabletop. And it has a really clever handle if you're unfamiliar with this design basically you have this push button here so we can rotate the handle around without tightening or loosening the mount to get it out of the way so say you get it nice and snug and this is sticking out you're going to bump into it your shirt's going to get caught on it things like that you can just press this button ta-da there you go now you've moved it out of the way but you haven't adjusted anything with the clamp itself so super clever we have our riser extension right here if needed and lastly we have the arm itself Pay attention, it is spring loaded, so they have a warning label there for you to take this off very easily. And then take a look at the very top with our mount here. We have the ability to do whatever we want to swivel, to rotate, you get the idea right there. Now let's go ahead, let's get this set up. Set up simple and straightforward. Step one is to attach the clamp to your desk or flat surface. Step two is to go ahead, you can take the arm, and just drop it right in place. And now basically you're all set and ready to go. Don't forget you do have the option to use the included extension here. Give you a little bit more height. Put that in first, then your arm, and you're ready to adjust and install your microphone, camera, things like that. Let's take this off for a second and I wanna show you that we also have the counterweight installed right here. This just slides on and off. So just line up the hole here like you see, and then it just slides right in place, nice and flush, not gonna be in the way. Again, easy to remove or add depending on how you have everything configured. All right, so we have our arm set up here and we have it configured with the Sony ZV-E10. I will be using this with this camera. Not only can you use this for your microphones, you can also use it for cameras like this. Great to have a couple, maybe one for each, but I wanted to show you what it looks like with the camera on it. And again, at the very end, we have this nice ball adapter so we can swivel and rotate this 360 degrees up or down to get the exact angle that we want to capture our shot. So maybe it's just like that. Maybe it's higher up above a computer monitor pointing you know, back down towards you. You can get very, very creative with this setup. Also I want you to see that we did use the built-in cable management to run a USB cable through here. We can connect that right into our camera and fish the rest of it through the other side of the arm and then out and connect it to our computer but very easy just go ahead you can just gently pry this open with your fingernail put your cable or cables in the channel and then you just press it back in place if you have used the low profile version of this they have a nice magnetic mount this one's more sturdy in the sense that it's going to stay in place where sometimes you might knock the magnetic one loose but i do like the convenience of the magnetic one a little bit better than this particular one but it's really up to you and honestly i don't think it matters that much but there we go we have it all set up everything's working great very customizable only thing you need to remember is to include the counterweight if necessary, depending on the weight of the item that you have installed on here. But very versatile, very capable, 
and I'm really happy with this arm overall. No glaring issues or anything like that. I would just argue that with Elgato products, there may be a premium that you're paying, but I would argue it's worthwhile and you definitely get what you pay for, especially in this case with a really nice high quality arm.